the vlog. Today is Monday, March 9th. It is the first official day of spring break. So I thought that I would make a vlog for you guys. I wanted to share a few things in today's vlog. This spring break, I am not going anywhere. I was supposed to go to San Diego to see Kate, the sleepy teacher, Vanessa, Jessica, Darren, and Marie, my sweet, sweet teacher tuber friends. But I decided not to because of the big flu coronavirus junk that's going around. I just made me nervous going to the airport and I know that I probably would have been fine, but I have a toddler to think about, so I'm not gonna get into that. But I wanted to share a couple things that I am doing this spring break. So I decided to spend my spring break cleaning and decluttering my home. So right now in the background, you're probably seeing a lot of trash, junk. That is because I am going by room by room and decluttering, cleaning out my house and then I'm actually gonna hire a housekeeper to come physically clean it because I, it's gonna take me the whole week just to go through each area of my home and get rid of things and I've already kind of started. So our closet is finished except for Scott's stuff. I'm gonna go through that today. Um, but my clothes, I went through all my clothes and got rid of like a huge pile. I'll show you guys the pile. Um, but I need to go through Scott's stuff. So this is my pile for the Goodwill. There's quite a few things in here um, that aren't clothes that have been already been going through. Um, some baby stuff I'm gonna take to Kid to Kid, which is like a resale shop for children's things. But anyway, so I just went through this cabinet over here in my kitchen. And uh, my mom and I went to Home Goods today and we got a few things for organization but one of the things we got today was this adorable plant stand it's like an enamel bucket with black legs and she thought of this really cute idea if we ever have people over we can like take the plant out put ice in it and serve drinks in that but this will not stay here it's just our shredder um we were going through a lot of mail and stuff but anyway this is the updated little space um i went through this this drawer and got rid of a lot of stuff that's like mail and like documents we need to keep. Um, usually we put it in this basket, but I wanted to get rid of it. Um, a couple, These drawers need to be gone through. Um, this one has like all my oils stuff in it, so probably won't really go through that. Um, and this one has like games, but I just thought that this corner looks so cute now. Um, we have like our family calendar. We put our mail in this, our Wi-Fi password. And then I got this cute little fiddle plant at Target. I'm gonna hope that I can keep that alive. <laughs> um, and then I took that other plant that was up here down and obviously put it in this pot and then ignore the mess because this is all part of my spring break plans. Then my ficus plant that was over there, I'm hoping that it can grow taller. So I repotted it into this kind of taller pot, hoping that the roots will kind of go down and grow um and then i did move a couple of my like faux plants around to kind of just make it look nicer so that's really new and then outside it's a mess but we did get a table to match our chairs and i put another faux plant out here i'm gonna have to watch this one because if it's windy it might get knocked down but these were on my hutch before and so I just moved them out here. And then this one over here as well, just another little sitting area um, because we moved some of Cash's like toys out there more. So that's what's going on. <clears throat> Hi, mom. You're so cute. <laughs> Isn't she the cutest mom ever? Mm -hmm. People say we look alike. It's true. <laughs> <laughs> she has helped so much. Um, I will show you guys the bathroom later, but Scott is actually getting ready for work. So I'm not going to go in there. Riv, are you living your best life today? Huh? What are you doing, Riv? What are you doing, Riv? Huh? What are you doing, Riv? Hi, Alice. Maybe I'll leave it outside and put an outdoor plant in it. I know it's gross. But anyway, so I'm going to um, finish up my bedroom today, closet and bedroom, 
And then tomorrow I'm gonna tackle the like living room space, kitchen area. All that back there all needs to be gone through and put away this hutch. There's like, it's just like a clutter case. Like it just holds junk and I just need to get rid of it. So all of this is gonna be gone through and cleaned out. So I'll update you guys as the process continues. But I was just really excited to share my little plant space. I think this little area is just so cute. I love it. I'm so happy. Um, ooh, real quickly, I wanted to share with you guys a little bit about my Skinny Tabs giveaway. So I'm gonna do that real quick right now. So I'm gonna be giving away two boxes of Skinny Tabs to one of you guys. The giveaway is actually running on my Instagram and here on my YouTube channel. So, um, like I said, two boxes are going to be given away. So, I love the Skinny Tabs for so many reasons. Um, they are amazing for helping with weight loss and with all-around health. So, in each box, you get 30 tabs. There are three of these little tubes in each box, and each of them has 10 tabs in it. Um, but the reasons why I love these is because they help you lose weight, flush toxins, burn fat, boost energy, and reduce bloating. That is by far the biggest benefit that I've noticed is the reducing of bloating. Um, they're also GMO-free, sugar-free, vegan, dairy-free, low-carb, keto-friendly, gluten-free, and soy-free. And some of the biggest ingredients that are super helpful is the burdock root, the dandelion, milk thistle, and the chlorella. Those are some of the biggest ingredients. There's also green tea extract in here, which means that each tab is about 40 milligrams of caffeine. Um, and so these do actually give you a small amount of caffeine for the day. And then they also offer the skinny weight drops. And I've used these, but I don't use these as religiously as the skinny tabs. The biggest thing for these are the craving fighting and the energy or the metabolism boost. I really do notice that when I take these tabs, I have less of a problem binging in between meals, and they really help with my um, fasting. So I kind of skip uh, breakfast in the morning, and these really help me get through the day until lunchtime. I usually don't eat lunch until about 11.30 in the afternoon when my kids eat. And so if I drink one of these in the morning, I notice that I really don't feel hungry as long as I drink about a cup of coffee. And I know that with intermittent fasting, there's all kinds of rules and stuff. And um, these skinny tabs have actually less than five calories in them. So if you drink the skinny tabs, you're not breaking your fast. Um, and then I drink coffee. So I guess most people would call that like a dirty fast. But I don't really follow the rules. I just kind of do what works for me. I have noticed the most... Um, the biggest thing I've noticed for me has been reducing of bloating. Like my face is a lot less bloated. Um, my arms and belly are a lot less bloated. And they really do help um, with fighting cravings. So I feel like that is the biggest um, thing that I have noticed after using the skinny tabs. Kind of a funny story. When I first ordered the skinny tabs, I actually saw an ad for them on Instagram. And so I decided to order two boxes of tabs and then a bottle of the Skinny Drops. Then I decided, why not? I reached out to them and mentioned how much I liked their product, and I actually became a brand ambassador. So I, I do partner with Skinny Tabs on this video. I don't get any, any money or any type of revenue from um, advertising the Skinny Tabs. I truly am. A lover of the product and I've been really fortunate to have been added to a wonderful community of people so many so many people have been affected by these beautiful skinny tabs and it's just lovely to have other women even men who have benefited from this and it it is a beautiful community um, I've got an ambassador page on Facebook that I'm in and so we all just kind of share um, how the skinny tabs are doing for us and it's really nice to bond with some other people who are using this, the skinny tabs and are benefiting from it. Um, <clears throat> so in order to win two free boxes of skinny tabs, there are a few things that you guys need to do. So to enter the giveaway, you need to be following me on Instagram at apples and tiaras and also be following the superfoods 
Tab's Instagram as well. They will be linked and shown here on the screen. And then you also need to be subscribed to my YouTube channel. Please make sure to comment either on this video or on my post for my superfoods tabs on my Instagram, and I will be choosing a winner from the comments. So I will be checking to make sure you're following both platforms and then just make sure to comment so that I can get a hold of you personally if you're selected for the giveaway. Okay guys, so I just pretty much finished the closet. So I wanted to show you guys. So I found this cute little rack at Home Goods and I bought it for every intention of doing exactly this with it, putting all my glasses on it and some more accessories. So like my bracelets, my perfumes, my glasses, I have rings. This is an empty space for whatever I need it to be for. <laughs> and then down here is where I store like all of my accessories, like jewelry, hats, um, smaller purses. And then this one is for makeup and hair products stuff. So like all my headbands are here and then like extra hair supplies. I do have some on my counter. This is just for like every day. So like that I don't really need to go into that little cabinet unless I have to, but it is there. And then um, I hung up all of Scott's clothes. We had some of them folded. I actually went through all of his clothes and ended up pitching a lot of them. So I have them organized here by um, sleeve length, starting this way, going that way, and then his uniforms on to like winter stuff. And then all of my stuff, these are all his shoes. Um, all my stuff is pretty organized. I have dresses and then I have, I go by sleeve length. I don't really do like color coordinating. Um, so sleeve length down to jackets. And then these are my teacher t-shirts and my teacher sweaters. So you guys can see those. Um, those are there. So these are just like my teacher tees. And then I ended up flipping the square things. I used to have them both here but I ended up flipping them going that way because this space was getting really cluttered. Sorry, I have some tissue from a purse. Um, but I do have a lot more room, which is great. I have like a bunch of empty little squares. So I really like how organized this got. Um, really nice and clean. All my Kate Spade bags are up there and then just like that kind of stuff. All of Scott's clothes fit in here. What's funny is that we were having Scott's clothes stored in this closet because we didn't have enough hangers, but since we pitched so many things out of our closet, we ended up having a ton of hangers left over. And this is the only laundry basket of like dirty laundry that needs to be washed. So I'm pretty sure that everything will fit on a hanger in the closet now, which is super, super amazing. So this cabinet, can go back to storing like we have shoes on the bottom too and then I'll be able to actually store like more stuff in there and then let me show you guys the bathroom cabinets so ignore the um tools and stuff but I reorganized my bathroom so I kept like basic needs stuff I use every day so like hair stuff and then like my makeup brushes that I use daily and then in here is just all of my products that I use daily. Down below is all of my hair stuff and then extra products that I don't use daily, but I don't want to get rid of them. And then this is like jewelry and makeup cleaning stuff. So I just keep that there. And then in this drawer, we have like all of our basic daily stuff. So like toothpaste, toothbrushes, Scotch razors, um, contacts, stuff like that. Our Smile Brilliant cases that have our teeth whitening stuff in them. And then down here is more of Scott stuff and like lotion and Q-tips. And then down here is all of our like medicine. Um, so just like random prescriptions we've had that we need to toss and like day quills and like other medicine goes in there. And then down here, we are going to start keeping our bath towels because we had these in the hall closet. And I was like, this is dumb. Like, why not just put them under the sink when you just grab them? So there is a towel spot in both bathrooms now under the sink. So there and then up on here are more of Scott's shaving needs. He has way too much, but whatever. And then down here is like bathroom electronic things. 
So that fit down there nicely. And then in the toilet room, I have this little guy, which I got at Home Goods. And in the top, I just have feminine products. And then this is all my nail stuff. And then down here is just extra toilet paper. And then I have this cute little setup. So like a candle and some poopery. And then other stuff, this needs to go away. These are the wheels. And then this is like an essential oil diffuser. Interesting. So I'm feeling really good about the organization going on. I didn't show you guys this cute little thing I got from, I got this cute little thing from Home Goods, and it has all of my daily makeup. So like my most used everyday stuff is right in there. So I can just kind of use that and then leave it on the counter and it looks really cute. And then just a candle of succulent. And I did get a snake plant for in here. It's an actual real snake plant. These are gonna go in our other bathroom, but an actual snake plant for in here. I think it's so cute. And my little salt, salt rock thing. I have to turn it off at night because I don't sleep well with it on. But anyway, feeling good about my bathroom and closet area. I need to clean the tub, put that stuff away. But like I said, I'm not gonna clean the house. I'm just gonna put everything away, get it organized, and then I'm gonna hire somebody to come clean it because that is just too much for me. So we gonna see how that goes. Thank you guys so much for watching. Keep looking back for my channel to see more organization of the rest of the house. And don't forget to enter the giveaway for those skinny tops. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye guys.